events which are designed to introduce prospective students to university life. Recently, a group of young people from Mancat came to find out about techniques involving DNA. Jeff Hyde tells us more. Okay, what we've been doing today is to, to run a series of experiments for um, college students and basically what we're aiming to do with the day is to teach them how to do uh, DNA fingerprinting. And what we do is we start out right at the beginning of the day with a set of cells which they can actually have a look at under the microscope and they can see that they're live cells. And they go through all the different stages um, of extracting DNA and, and using a technique known as the polymerase chain reaction. So we give them a couple of unknown samples at the beginning of the day and what they can do by the end of the day is they can tell which one is which using their DNA fingerprinting technique. Um, what we try to do is we try to give them a good experience of, of university life as well, so we give them a few lectures to give them some background information. We get them in the laboratory doing a lot of practical work and we also um, do a few demonstrations, so there's some uh, really rather expensive and sophisticated equipment that we show them how it works um, just so that they can see what kind of things uh, people use in a, a modern research environment like the one we've got here at Salford University. We give them sort of pointers as to, to the kinds of things that, that they can do at university. So we, we get our admissions tutor to come along and talk to them at the end of the day and uh, she can explain to them what kind of courses are available and, uh, and how they might be able to carry on this sort of thing if they wanted to come and, uh, and, and join us at Salford University. We do a whole range of, uh, of biological sciences here, so uh, DNA studies are a part of the, what we call the molecular uh, biosciences, so they can do that um, as, as part of a biochemistry degree or as part of a pharmaceutical, sorry, part, pharmaceutical sciences degree. Um, they can also uh, do it as part of the mainstream biology degree as well. We also do sort of uh, courses in, in environmental uh, biology, so um, things that uh, are what we call whole organism biology, organismal biology, and these include programs in wildlife and practical conservation, wildlife in zoo biology, as well as a, a mainstream biological uh, degree where they cover all sorts of things from uh, ecology to uh, physiology and, and other whole organism biology. So there's a kind of wide variety of jobs that, 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 that students can do with their biology degrees. Um, they can go into, obviously, into forensic science and, and they can carry on the kind of DNA fingerprinting that we've done here. Um, we, they also can go into things like pharmaceutical sciences where uh, working with drug companies like AstraZeneca to help uh, design, develop and, and manufacture drugs. A lot of students go into teaching so they can get enthused by their experiences as biologists at university and go on and, and pass that on to, to other, other potential students. Um, and also people just move out of biology as well, so some people just move straight into management jobs and, uh, and, and, and the, the biology was their interest but, but they, they move on to, to something else. Mm -hmm.